Hello friends, this is DMC Aim and this is my quick review of Coffee Pods Intense Lungo um, Coffee Capsules and I was looking around Tesco and I seen that this was the only one that they really had on offer um, when I was in there and this was on offer at £3.50 it is um, 20 capsules in this one so if we take a look on the front of the box it says strength number 9 20 capsules good strong coffee there um, Nespresso compatible on the side it always tells you the um, origin of the coffees on these um, tasting notes dark chocolate chestnut and spice and the origin is Brazil Central America and obviously India for that sort of um, strong caffe caffeine and um, robusta taste that they seem to like in these coffee um, cafe pod capsules um, Nespresso compatible capsules contents 20 capsules containing freshly roasted and ground coffee and there it is in French and Spanish um, contact information there um, coffee pod um, they're on Facebook and Twitter and on the back of the pack it says life flavors life favors those who do the bold, the passionate, the restless, the determined, those who get on with it. These are the people we make coffee for. These are cafe, cafe pod people. We believe in the mantra, quality in, quality out. That's why we invest time and energy in, into sourcing great coffee, great partners and great people. All this in the pursuit of one thing, good, strong coffee. So there we go. Store in a cool, dry place, pa packaged in a protective atmosphere, and there we go. It's a hundred and five grams in this box. Um, not much on the side, not much on the top, and we have the best before date on the bottom, which is the fifth of twenty nineteen. So just under a year on the best before date on this one. I have noticed actually that there's a bit of a um, shortage of capsules in some shops because of the um, European CO2 shortage. Um, I don't know whether they actually use um, CO2 in the production of um, coffee pods, but as I say, there seems to be a little bit of shortage um, of that, uh, amongst other things. Um, and I've noticed the um, supermarkets are really rationing um, fizzy drinks at the moment um, because of that. So that is it for the pack, um, I'll just break it open if I can remember how to do it with these, it says rip down to open there, push up and then we have to rip the top of the box which I will make a mess of and there we go, um, sort of nice pinky pinky metallic um, colour to these, they look very silver on there but there is a sort of champagne sort of look to the um, to the coffee pod so what I'll be doing is I'll be trying these out over the coming days before I make um, me more determined um, um, view on this coffee so what I'll be doing is I'll be trying it out and then I'll come back with my uh, more detailed thoughts well I've had a chance to try these out over the um, last day or two or three days actually because 20 capsules is a lot and um, I've only bought them in tens um, in the past but these as I say as I mentioned these were on offer at £3.50 for 20 in Tesco it was the only box that they um, had on offer all the other cafe, cafe pod um, um, capsules were all um, full price so um, as I say I've had a chance to try them out and the taste well it's quite nice um, it's sweet and smooth with that intense caffeine taste from the um, Southern Indian Robusta um, influence 
that has a sort of spicy side with a slight pepper, pepperiness. Um, it's slightly smoky as well. Um, the pack description is quite accurate with the dark chocolate and the slight nuttiness there too. Um, it's well balanced though with the most standout thing being that sort of warmth in the mouth from that um, spiciness um, mentioned. I think I did mention in my other other reviews of Coffee Pod that I couldn't drink them um, for enjoyment because of that high caffeine content making me feel a bit queasy. Um, but these are a little more mellow and nice to drink. So if you like your coffee in the middle lane, um, because the other ones really, I think it was the um, live wire and the supercharger, they were breaking the speed limit. They were doing like, what, 95 miles an hour in the third lane. Um, but these ones, these are a little bit more sedate. So these are, yeah, um, middle lane coffee, these ones. Um, so yeah, maybe these are for you. Um, so, as I say, a decent coffee, and I, I would I would happily drink these. So I can recommend them. They're, they're quite a decent coffee, and they're not as um, intense as the other um, coffee pod ones. So I'd like to hear from anyone who's um, tried these pods. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more coffee reviews in the future, subscribe to my channel. That was my quick review. Thanks for listening. Bye for now.